<laughs> okay. Now we're on to the do, which is the business plan, which Vicky is going to be kicking in. And hopefully we've um, had you define your business plan and wanted you to check with the estate agents some of your assumptions around, is that product going to hit that customer segment? I'm sure it will, but just double check because, you know, those 22-year-old guys with the spiky hair are more expert in their quarter of a mile radius than we are. Yep. Yeah, you need to go meet. Yeah, I employed that. Yeah, he was 22 at the time. He's now older. So we're going to be writing your business plan, having a look at you writing your business plan. In your folders, you've got a short business plan and a long business plan. I still use that format, you know, and I generally, my, my thinking is whatever I want to achieve, I will give my team and myself much bigger targets than I actually want to achieve. So Holly and Vicky, close your ears at the moment. And we're going to come on to some KPIs that you see for Ash. Now, Ash is ahead of his actual targets that I want him to achieve, but behind the targets I've given him. And I do that on purpose, because if you only write the targets that you want to deliver, you're probably going to drop back from them because you only because life is what it is. If you write targets. So, for example, Internally, I want Ash to deliver 50 deals a year. And I think he's now delivered 47 and he's got two and a half months to go. Fine. He thinks he's got to deliver 72 deals a year. So our customers are told we have a deal flow of around 50 deals a year. Last year we did 63. So quite clearly, he's going to hit the same level. So are any of our customers going to get grumpy with us about deal flow? We're seriously over delivering. But he's running to try and hit 72, which is fine because that's almost one and a half times what I actually want him to deliver, which is fine by me. Just don't discuss it with him. OK, and um, so I always make targets bigger than actually what I need to happen so that you can miss every single target, but still hit what you really want to happen. And I think that's quite important because I think we generally slightly miss the real targets. So make the real targets just got some space in them. 